Hi, Tyl from Inner Fidelity at the Rocky Mountain Audio Fest Can Jam 2013 again at a booth of the newbie first timer of the show, but certainly not a newbie in the world of audio and attending shows, and certainly not a newbie personally. My friend John Bevier, I've known since since I started Headroom, 25. 25, 25, 25 years, years ago, ago. Yeah. a long, long time. Uh, he now represents Focal in the United States, uh, a headphone, uh, uh, Focal, of course, a company that's been long doing stuff uh, in high-end audio, recently introducing a line of headphones, and I'm really stoked to see them here at CanJam. Hi, John, how are you? Hey, Kyle, how are you, <laughs> It's sir? good to see you, mate. It's always to be here in yeah. the scene. So, tell us about your headphones. So, we have three headphones that we've debuted over the past two years. We started out with this portable model uh, called the Spirit One. It retails for $279. As you can plainly see, it is a closed cup, circumoral design, twin hinges to make sure it fits tightly against uh, the skull, doesn't compress the pinna down, uh, single-sided cable routing that is component-oriented uh, with an Apple-certified um, volume control and changing tracks up and down. Uh, the next piece that we've introduced about six months ago now is the uh, Spirit Professional. This was designed and EQ'd for the mastering engineer. Flat EQ, no uh, uptick, uh, gain stage in the bottom end frequencies to overcome uh, loud ambient that you would on a portable product. So really meant for studio use. Uh, a very tough uh, um, skin uh, paint job. You can throw it all over. Uh, same articulation, uh, double articulation in the headband, same stainless steel uh, framing. We ship that with a 10-foot curly cable that has, like all of our products, a quarter-inch to eighth-inch screw-on adapter. Uh, and then the product that we are just debuting, this is the first time it's really been seen in public by the consumer uh, industry, is the uh, Spirit Classic. Uh, this retails for $399 and is a nice evolutionary change between something that was on purpose, big EQ'd, something that's very, very flat for the studio. This is right in the middle. We use uh, memory cups, uh, a memory foam on the ear cushions, uh, the same sealed back cup, the same double articulating headband, a little bit less caliper pressure. We ship that with a four meter oxygen free copper cable uh, in addition to the uh, one meter uh, portable cable that we ship all these with and uh, each of these has a one-year parts and labor warranty and we think people are just absolutely going to love it. Great and what are the prices? Uh, 279 for the Spirit 1, 349 for the Spirit Professional, 399 for the Spirit Classic. And they're all available now? or uh, The Spirit 1's available, the Pro's available, this will be out and in stores in about three weeks. Excellent and uh, uh, we're going to give John a little more time on the screen here. Why don't you show us your amplifiers? Yeah, all right. So I've got two of them with us. Uh, over in this direction is a French manufacturer by the name of Micro Mega. This is the DAC Magic. It's $350 DAC. And then next to it is the MyZik, which is a headphone amplifier at $299. Uh, Danielle Shar at Micro Mega has been the designer of the brand for years now. Uh, very, very high quality for not a lot of money. Uh, over on this side is a slightly more um, Italian, for sure, manufactured by the name of Pathos. This is the Orium, uh, as well as the Converto. I had to look at the poster because I forgot the doggone name. Um, the Orium is, or the Converto is the D to A converter, and uh, the other is a headphone amplifier. These are Class A, zero feedback, tube driven pre driver stage, uh, Burr Brown decks inside. Um, balance as well as large scale gain on the back and then your main gain on the front and they sound absolutely terrific. I think we did a review on that. Yes, uh, you did and as I remember you liked it quite a bit. Well, uh, I, I certainly liked it quite a bit but uh, the, I think the review was done by uh, Skylab Rob and uh, and he, I know that he liked it he quite did. a bit. Yeah, so... Uh, balanced inputs, balanced outputs. Yeah, cool. Mm -hmm. I love this guy. I really, really do. Thanks, that's, John. I really appreciate that's it. That's because we spent time in jail together. <laughs> <laughs> All right, folks. We'll see you at the next booth.